you know, and it's kind of weird because it happens so much now. I think you know we we humanise animals so much, particularly in the media, that we just sort of tune it out. We don't even notice anymore. I I remember seeing an advert last year. Does anyone remember this advert from Oxfam? Right, last year, did anyone get or give one of these goats? Yeah. Oh, quite a few. So it's quite popular. It was a goat that you gave. Yeah. Right, because the idea was, right, for you, you, those who don't know, um, they had a, a, a catalogue where you would basically, instead of buying someone a present they don't want, you would buy a goat that they would send to an African village. And you give your friend a, a card saying, Happy Christmas, here's a goat you'll never see. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Thanks. Did you get or, or give the goat? It took it to me. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You've got a little taxi driver on there. That's <laughs> <laughs> quite nice. I actually bought three and gave one to myself. <laughs> Why not splash out on a goat? 14 quid. You push the boat out, sunshine. I paid 30 for mine, I think. Really? Oh, you've got jit. <laughs> Unless it was like a deluxe goat. It might have been. I never know. Um, <laughs> But basically, they had loads of different things in this catalogue, though, didn't they? They were like really useful things for African villages. Uh, things like the, the toilets that you could send to an African village. Not so many people buying those. That's not a great gift, really. It's like, uh, Happy Christmas, your present is currently being shat on by strangers. <laughs> um, but the goats, like I say, really popular. They flew off the shelves. And I think part of the reason is that this goat has been excessively humanised, right? For a start off, it's, he's got a stethoscope. <laughs> I'm guessing it's not fully medically qualified. <laughs> if it was, it would be worth more than 40. Maybe that's why yours was 30 quid. It, it actually done a St. John's Ambulance course or something, new CPR. You never know. Um, what I find most sinister about this, though, if you look a little bit closer at the goat's face, right? Now, look, look how cute that goat is. That's a cute goat. Has anyone ever seen a goat close up? Yeah, yeah they're, they're right. They have fucking scary eyes, don't they? Anyone who's been menaced by a goat will be able to vouch for this. If you have been menaced by a goat, this is what it would look like, right? <laughs> That's what a goat actually looks like. They have scary fucking eyes, right? But what they've done here, if you can see, is they've actually photoshopped the eye of the goat to make it more appealing so that people like this gentleman here think, oh, fine, that's, what, that's what's going to turn up in Africa. No, that's not what's going to turn up in Africa. This is what they're getting. <laughs> <laughs> that's you bought three of those fucking things. They're menacing an African village as we speak. They are shitting themselves. The big problem, no one's bought the toilet either. It's fucking carnage. <laughs> Carnage out there, you're not to blame. 